called Casa Gerardo. You just stand there, I will go across the street to take a good shot of this front, okay? Casa Gorordo. Let's take a video of this one. Okay, the house was built in the mid 18th century by Alejandro Reynes E. Rosales. Okay, later we will read that later, okay? Okay, so you tell a story. Now you tell a story, okay? Now let's register there first. I think you need to register. Come here. You register first, baby. This is really nice. Imagine if you lived here. They register their baby. Do you know what to register means? You write your name. Ready? <laughs> go, go, baby. Ready, day. Wow. Ah, this is so. Oh, it's aircon. Good afternoon. Uh oh. The staffs told us that we are not allowed to take videos. Only pictures. So these are pictures we took around the museum. So these are religious statues. Paddles and crab trap. Pestle and mortar to remove rice husks. The lacquer, which means hat. Coffee beans grinder. Chocolate dresser. These are wood grinder on the left and a stone mill on the right. Carasa or vote for parade. This is a cow with a sled in the back. So this is a carabao. And this is the carabao sled. This is Tartanilia. And these are vehicles. A yellow bus and a red jeep. And a train. A catalog. Wow. They have a pink bicycle under the stairs. Look at their shiny concrete floors. And hard wide wooden doors. Steps to a platform which is also like a hallway leading up to the stairs. Low and large windows, wow. Grand wooden staircase. Those display things. 
This beautiful, beautiful partition divides the sala and the dining area. The room next to the prayer room is the toilet and bath. A huge living space just before the dining that had the musical instruments, the harp, the gramophone, and the piano. This is the library or study room. I am typewriting! <laughs> it's an old typewriter. And now the dining room, very airy with the large windows. Looking out into the balcony and out into the lawn. Oh, the super gorgeous dining at cutlery sets. Um, pearl and gold, so beautiful. This is the kitchen beside the dining room. A cooking pot. I think they cook paksil there. The sink. I love the design of their kitchen, baby. Makes me want to cook there. Floor to ceiling cabinet for glasswares. Oh, the long, long balcony! A lot of greens around, wow! There are plants hanging from the balcony. What balcony? From the roof. Oh yeah! have a souvenir shop with a lot of wicker furnitures and hanging lamps. So pretty! This is the end of the tour! I hope you had fun with our video. You can come and visit when, when you go to Cebu and you can meet this museum. If only you have time! Bye guys! Thank you for watching! Please like and subscribe and share this video! Bye! I love you all! God bless!